We begin the current daf from the Sechta's Gitten daf Lamed Beis. We begin five lines down at the top of the Amud. We begin the the fourth parak in the Sechta's Gitten parak Hashaleach, which continues on the theme really again of the whole Masechta up until this point about bringing a get, sending a get, and that's what we continue regarding the Shliach Lahilacha of that's being sent from the husband to the wife sending the get. Shiz corresponds with Kazakh and Cheska. Turn to the Bebchem Bishim Shem today's daf. So we're discussing today's daf are the halachas of Bittel. How do you void a get? And where the void in the shlichus also voids the actual get itself. Now, regarding bitla get, you have to consider several factors. One is litziurah mechaben. Is he doing it just to bother her, to pain her? And shlichus the basra regarding which agency do you consider more significant, the first shlich or the second shlich you send after him to be mevatel his shlichus. Also, regarding the lotion of the bitla, depends on libatel mashma. Does it sound like that you're going to be mevatel, or is it mikar kama? You're saying that it was bottle, and that will be significant in regards to what you're trying to say. The shlich of a matano, of avoiding the shlichus there when you're giving a gift, that would depend whether hoylich kazachi. When you say here, hoylich matano zeh leplaini, well, is hoylich mean like bizeicha? Once it's zeicha, it's already you can't be mavatla anymore or not. The Allah of chayzim agarish, but if you mavatla get, can you then go ahead and then subsequently use it again? Or do you say, no, once you mavatla, it's like a piece of dirt and there's earth and there's nothing to do with it anymore? Which that relates to the concept of asa dibur mavatla dibur. Uh, can you have speech, nullify speech, or do you say you have to have a maisa to mvatl a diva? So we begin the current dav, dav lama beis, five lama dav at the top of the yama, we begin the fourth parak of Masechtis Git. Hashileach get leishter. If someone sends a get to his wife, begiyah b'shleach, and then the husband sends the shleach, he left Bezdin, he's walking out, he goes to the grocery, and he sees the shleach, the guy that he sent to go deliver the get to his wife. Oi, or a different case. Shashalach achav shleach. So a few hours later, and he's, he suddenly he's, he's feeling regret. He walks into an empty house. He says, this is not going to work. He quickly calls over the neighbor. He says, do me a favor. Go catch this guy. And he tells him, so either one, either he bumps into the guy in the grocery store or he sends someone else after. He says, get you nisad bottle. The get I sent to with you to my wife, it's null and void. Says the Mishnah, hareza bottle. It is null and void. Now, says the Mishnah further. Kidem etzel ishtoy. Let's say... He sent the shliach, but he quickly got into his car. He drives over to the wife's house. Oh, he says, quickly drive over to my wife's house and go ahead and and he tells her, get shashalach The get that I sent you, it's on the way. It's uh, the tracking is tells us it should be here in three hours. Bottle who it's void. Allah is a bottle. It is void. No, the thing is, but it says the mission, but if the get already got to her hand, then you can't be mavat anymore, which is more going to ask, obviously, once it's been lost in the yada, obviously she's divorced, but that's already too late. Now, very shayna, in the beginning, he wouldn't be mavat lit in front of a shliach, he wouldn't be mavat lit in front of, meaning the shliach that he sent, he wouldn't be mavat lit in front of the woman, rather, where he was, he would do like this, he would do like this, he would make a bezin elsewhere. He would just go to shul, get three people, and the mavatl says, hindi media, ani mavatl as I get And that's it. He had a bezin and his mavatl. His mil hazagim, mil the elder instituted no shli yisakain that they shouldn't be able to do this netikun ha'elam because of a remedy for the world because the shliach doesn't know anything about it and he's going to bring it to her. She doesn't know anything about it and she didn't get married. And that's going to cause major problems, mamzeiches and everything. So they were instituted. You got to get, either get to the shliach, got to get to the isha, but you can't just make some bezdin and mavatel the get. Now the Gemara makes a few different diyukim in the halacha of our mishnah. The mishnah open up by saying if you send a get to his wife, and it says v'higiyah b'shliach. So, so the Gemara says v'higiyoi. The if it would have said v'higiyoi, that would have sounded like that it was running after him, and he caught up to him. Like it, he doesn't say this. It's a ligia. Ligia sounds like Bafalumela. Even if he was just, they were, they were, they were there in the rest stop and they were, they were both on the way back from the Bezdin, which they had to go out to who knows where out, you know, to get to the Bezdin. And then they both stopped in the rest stop and he sees him, bumps into him. And uh, even so, we're going to say, you know what? It's bottle. It's going to be bottle. What's the chiddush in that? But William Rina, we don't say he had no mind doing the bottle of this because he wasn't trying to catch this guy. It's rather let's see ura, just to bother her a month or two. Who do come a chavan? That's what he's intending to do because if he really wanted to mavatlet, 
he would have been chasing after this guy to catch up to him. So that's the Chiddush of the Mishnah, that no, we're not Cheshish for that. Even if he just happens to bump into him, we say it is a real bitl. It's not just like bothering and like, oh, she's got to go back and call up her up again and say, what's going on over here? I thought we said we were done with this. Now, the Mishnah then continued and said the next case was So one, one case was either he bumped into the Shliach and he says, it's Batl, or he sends another guy after the first guy and he says, eh, hey, Batl. So I said, Lomali, what do you need that case for? What's that teaching us? He says, the Basra. You can't say that the second guy's agency is better better than the first guy's agency. The Levatli, that it should nullify because he said, you're not better than me. What I had I was told by him to say to bring it. You're telling me that he said to, to nullify it, which is a, yeah, you could say why well, what do I mean? So after that, he said hey, after the Lamaiza were both shluchim, you're a shlichim valam shlich to do. So you would think maybe you're not any better. Come ask Mulan. Which sounds like a little interesting that uh, that chiddush that what do you mean that uh, he's that's a post that's the second one but akapanim who said that again we're both shluchim that's what we say kabbalah that no that the second shliach can be mevatel the first shliach then the mishnah continues at a different case one way is you mevatel by getting the shliach the other one is kadim who etzel ishtai if he instead of getting to the shliach he doesn't know where the shliach is doesn't have a tracking device and then he knows his wife is at home so quickly he runs to to her. So says, what do you need that case for? Why is that any different than the shliach? Says, what would you say, Kilo? I'm reading the two When do we not say that he's doing it just to bother her? And he tells her that she doesn't know it. She's not any of the wiser. He, he had fi- finalized it. They cratched up the shliach before. But to her, he wanted to know, by the way, you're going to be getting a package with yours. It's null and void. So he just wants to bother this. Uh, Woman that he doesn't get along with, Mashallah is saying no. If he if he gets her before and he's not doing just to bother her, he wants to mavatla. The next case was He sent someone quickly, his neighbor Reuven, quickly go over to my wife and go ahead and mavatla. Says him, what do you need that case for? What's again? Okay, what's the difference, him or the shliach? Says him, what would you say? No, Ihu, the guy himself, who He's not going to go through the effort when he himself goes and he's mavatla. You're not going to say a dait de litzeura that his intention is just to bother her, because lamaisa you want to bother people, but you don't want to go through a major effort to have to bother. So then you'll say it wasn't litzeuka mechadim. He himself rises over to us. Okay, he really wants some mevatli, but shliach. But when he just sends somebody else, he pays for an Uber to go over and 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 deliver a message. We say talech b'slei kitagach. Doesn't care when this agent has to go through the effort. We say, no, most definitely just wants to bother her. And he doesn't care about the tircha of the last shliach. So you would say maybe when he sends a shliach to her house, it's really just to bother her, and it's not to be mavat. Much more that is for Bittal. Now, Taisus says that he doesn't understand that, um, how is it possible that, that you're saying that, the guy's screaming and saying, I want mavat, and you're saying that, no, he just wants to bother her. What, what, does, that, what does that mean? Like, you know, you're saying, oh, maybe we would say, what, 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 are, what are you saying? It's like, it's like a man So he says that you would have thought that since he doesn't bring Adam on this, so therefore maybe he doesn't really want Mavatla. If he really wanted Mavatla, you would have had Adam. Or he says, no, we would have been Cheshul HaHachmer, because maybe he's doing it just to bother her. Kamash we're not concerned, but it's, it's interesting that the Gemara is saying, he said, Ech, Ech, So what are you telling me? You would have thought that, what, it wouldn't be a bitl? Ech, Zog is batl. So it says that, yeah, because you really want to bother her, but Adam was so you really just want to bother her, forget it. Lama chup, you know? But like upon them, that's what the Gemara says. No, even when he sends a shliach to the wife, it's not just litzio. Now, then the Mishnah said, but these were two cases of getting to the shliach, or two cases of getting to the woman. But said the Mishnah, Mishigig at Liyad, the ones to get reached to her hand, then then it's too late. Then he cannot be mavatla anymore. Says the Mishnah, obviously. Uh, you're ready to become a Yad, it's a done deal. So it's going to be it's necessary to mahadala mikura libetuli. He was trying to get to her all along to Mavatla. He's racing down the parkway, he's like he's trying to beat out this 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 guy who he already sent like 20 minutes ago. Mountain, what would you say? Gloy mil slama freya trajactal vil de betuli batle that he wanted to nullify it. So therefore, maybe he would say that it's bottle mashmon that not, which as Taisa explains, that uh, the reason for this is because when, when he was running, meaning 
it sounds like actually that that Giludas should actually be bitl. Because this is what we'll see later on, that Lamadal, this halach of Giludas Begit, it, it is milsi, it is significant. So Takawai, it does not work. If the guy's che- running down the parkway, why don't you say that Giludas, that running down, that flooring it at 120, why don't you say that that's uh, not a Giludas? So he says, because when he was running, you don't know what his intention was. Um, not for the shlich, not for the woman, not for the bezin. So it's dvarm should believe that's not dvarm. So even though he's believed to say that was what his intention was, but it's not going to work to create a bitl in the get. So there is a havamin over here. You really would think that there's a giladas, as we'll say in the Avlava Daud, that maybe should be mevatlid. So we don't know what you were racing down for. Maybe you wanted to go celebrate with her when she's divorced or something. So No, 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 he was running. He was running. Right, right. So I will say on the Avlam Adalad, right, right. If you know exactly that, um, that some type of a giloy, that, um, that uh, like, but, but, but the, if you don't know, because the shlich thinks he's running after him to say, good, 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 go, go, go. You know, so it has to be, um, as I mentioned, telling us that, no, it's love Klumhu. It's not, it's not anything that's going to tell us uh, necessarily that case, because if it would be, then you could, it could be, it would taka be a bitl because of gila das. So now, regarding this whole halacha bitl, so the Gemara brings turn up on the brysa, that, how do how do you do a bittel? So we say you catch the shleich before you catch the one before. Okay, mevatlet. But what wording do you use? Talking about learn the brayso. Let's say he says butlhu. Butlhu, even though it's in the present tense, it sounds like you're saying it should be bottle. Bottle is bottle, meaning it's like mekan laba. It's it's a future tense, which makes sense. You're being mevatel it. Let's say you say ef shibai. I don't want it. But those are valid ways of being mavatl again. But let's say you say pasalhu. Now pasalhu doesn't sound like you're being mavatl. It just sounds like you're saying it, it, it's not valid, which is not true. It's not, it's not invalid. It is valid. You just want to nullify it. So, well, let's say you say ain't a get. It's not a get. So let me come. You haven't said anything. Well, it's not a get. It is a get. It's not pasal. It's kosher. So says the Gemara, remembers that to say the bottle. When you say bottlehu, you're telling me lishnu de levatel mashma. That sounds like it's a wording of the future that you're saying that it should be bottle. Ah, Some say it was matanam. Someone receives a gift. They after he got the gift in his hand, so someone comes over to him. He says, oh, I'm so, you know, I'm so so sorry. Whatever, what this didn't work out. Whatever. He comes over with this big box of chocolates, and after he got it. He says, Matana Zuma Batalas. This gift is, is nullified. Or Tivatil, it should be nullified. Or EF Shaba, I don't want this. Says the bra, says the the, the Amira, Loy Maklum, he hasn't said anything. Meaning, against his will, he already merited it. He already was Makablet. And therefore, what's the significance of this? If let's say he has a creditor, that creditor could collect that gift because of him. Because all these terminologies are future tense. And once you accepted it, you can't back out because you want to say now it's too late. You already got it. You already received the gift. Now you're saying, oh, it should be it's too late. But let's say you say betelehi. Betelehi sounds like that it was bottled before I received it. Oh, then enamata, or, or let's say it says enamatana. It's not a gift. So Dvarv Kayam and his words are valid because this is what's known in halacha as haidois baldin kime edim dami. It's like he's saying, I never was in it. And therefore it goes back to the giver, and therefore then the creditor of this recipient cannot go ahead and collect from it. And this is how the Bryce teaches teach later on the practice of Mem and Bayes, that if one guy says, look, I wrote, and I gave this field to that person, and the other guy says, you didn't write and give it to me. That's called, it's like his admission is like a hundred witnesses. And he wrote so where he says, it was bodily before, and he's believed to say this. But, but, but the main thing we want to bring out from this that we're asking from is, you see, Batil, when he said the words, that's indicating that it was prior because, like we said, saying a Lashon Asid is not going to work over here. Here you need the exact opposite. You have to make it that it's like you never received it. So, so Betela and Batil is the same word. So, but Batil who, it sounds like you're saying is, is a past tense, but you're telling me in the context of Gittin, it's a future tense, and that's why it works. Because it was past and it wouldn't, because it, it, it wasn't bottle. You want the matlin now. So which one is it? Is it past or future? So Mabaya Bay says bottle as a contingent base, which is a very important principle in general. Things depend on context. It can it can be understood in two different ways. And since that's the case, 
we would generally presume that when a person claims something, he's making a claim that would be effective in the context that he's saying. So, mashma de it, it, it means past tense. Umashma de it also means future tense, that it should be bottle. Okay. Gabi get regarding the Allah of our Mishnah get Lishna de Mahani become. When the guy is saying bottle, as looked allusion, that's going to say a wording that will be effective over here, which is a future tense. I want to nullify this. Gab Matana, when the recipient of the gift, who doesn't want this, Lishna de Mahani become, he's saying a terminology is effective, which is past tense. Saying it never was a Matana, so it's not a contradiction. Now, I'm Abaya. Abaya says, um, relating to what we said, and also regarding the Allah of the Mishnah, he says, Naktina, we have a tradition, meaning we, we hold on that the Allah is, Shliach Matana, when someone sends an agent for a gift, Hareka Shliach Haget. He's like the agent of a get, meaning that if the giver is Mavatal the get, the Matana, before the Makabal receives it, it's going to be nullified. Which, Nafkamina, the ramification of this is, Lahoilech Lav Kazachidami. It's only in the gay if you hold. So although Matan is a schos, he could back out because when you say Hailuch is love Kazachadami. Taisa says this is only relevant for Matana, not by get, because even if it was a schos, it wouldn't be effective. It's only for the halacha of that was saying by the Matana. If you say Hailuch Matan is since you're saying not Zaycha, you're saying Hailuch. So he wasn't Zaycha because if you say it was Zaycha, the Shlich was already Zaycha, he can't back out anymore. But since we're saying that it's lav kazachi, it's like the Allah of get that we said in our Mishnah, that as long as you chop mois before he gives it to the recipient, you can back out. Right, matona is a schus if you say a terminology of allowing schus. But if you're saying hoylech, then you're saying it's not a schus. So you can't be zoicha for him. You can't go to my pantry and take out something. I'm being zoicha for this guy only if I allow it. I'm saying hoylech, it's lav kazachi dami. And therefore, I could back out up until it receives, uh, the recipient receives it. Now, could, yeah, that was exactly, that was, that was different. That was regarding the Makabal that he's saying is la maton, uh, bottle who, yeah, that was regarding the, the recipient not wanting to be Makabal. And this is regarding the, the, the Shalech, right? Um, now, regarding the, going back to this thing that we spoke about different terminologies of being about Leget, so Avina Ashkechel Rav Nachma Yitzchak. The Tully, he was leaning, the He was leaning on the bolt of the door. Okay. We find that many times with Shaz, what the significance of that is. But he asked him the following question. Bottle. The guy said bottle, but he didn't say the word who. I Meaning we just said before, bottle who is a is a good way of, of, of nullifying the get. But let's say he only said the word bottle. Ma, what's the halacha? Does that sound like the past? And therefore, his words would have no significance because he didn't say the word who. Because who really is the present slash future. Well, they say, no, even without who, it means to the shyness. And they say in the terminology that would be effective, which is the future tense. As you go take a list, that's not clear. You just say the word bottle. Bottle, bottle what? Bottle who is saying it should be bottle, meaning it would mean the, the present, the, the future. But it's not clear. You just said the word bottle. What would, what would that mean? Now, I'm a rapsheshis. Some say it was about Masnidita, it wasn't Amari, but rather it was a Brisa, a whole list of, of wordings that are being said. Let's say get the loyal. This get should not be effective. Loyate should not permit. Loyazib it should not uh, forsake her. Lo it shouldn't send her away. Lo it shouldn't divorce. Ye cheres, it should be earthenware. Ye kicheres, it should be like earthenware. Okay, Dvarv Kriyamna, all these words are valid because these are all indicating that it is inherently good, but I want to make that it shouldn't be good anymore. But let's say you say ain't a mile, not yoyal, but mile, where all these terminologies, uh, this sounds like that he's not being mavatlet, he's just testifying that it's invalid. But we don't see any psalm regarding it. And just go ahead and be of. So if he says it's not effective, ain't a matter, it does not permit, ain't a mazav, it does not let her go free, ain't a mashalech, it does not send her away, ain't a mageresh, it does not divorce, cheresu, it is earthenware, kecheresu, it is like earthenware. All these words, he hasn't said anything because all these wordings are indicating a past tense, which is not true. So it's again the same theme that we said regarding future and past. Now, Ibar the following question. Behold, it, it, is, it is earthenware. Ma, what's Allah? Does that sound like future tense? Or does it sound like past tense? He 
He says, what do you mean? Why is it different? Your words are harehu cheres. Why is it different than harehu hektish? Which we hold, it is making it something hektish. And we find this many times in Shas. We learn the mission in Durham, that he says, if it's mine, they harehen mukdashim lashemayim. So you see, harehu hektish is making it hektish. So why is harehu cheres any different? So to by Hefka, we learn the same thing in the Mishnah, Hadehu Hefka. So then he says, Hadehu Hef Mufka Luchomisha Echbert. It is Hefka for whoever I want. So obviously we see that the terminology is a future tense and it's going to be effective. So therefore it says the Gemara, that's clear that Hadehu Cheres would be a valid way of invalidating the get. No, that's what I'm saying. The Gemara is saying it's not. The Gemara is saying that Cheres uh, who, Oke who is saying that that's what it is. Well, maybe, yeah. Right. Exactly. Harehu Hektish is saying that, yeah, dos vilich is ozan. You know what I'm saying? But, uh, but now the Gemara has a question. Let's say, interesting question the Gemara has. It's really a real uh, alumnus in, in, in the whole halacha of Bittal. If the husband changes his mind, he's like a little flip flopping. He changed his mind. He, he wrote a get. He went and he was mavatlet. Now he changed his mind. Now he wants to divorce her now. With the get that he was mavatlet already. So the question is, could he go back with the original get that he wrote, that he was mavatl? Oh, I'm trying to get it. He already spent all this money on the dayun and everything. He's changing my, you know what? I am done with you. And he wants to divorce her. Could he go and divorce with the same get? Or in the Khazim or could he not go ahead and divorce her with the same get? What's the question? Do we say when you mavatl the get, you said bottle who? Whatever wording you said, cheres who. So that's it. It's like a piece of earth. It's, it's nothing. You nullified it. You made it null void. Or maybe no, the shlichus of the shlich is what is mavatl until he goes back and he makes a new shliach. But the get is not bottle. Right, right. So then, yeah, so that doesn't seem to be the question. That would seem to be then, then that would be mavatl. But that's also going to be part of the question of how, how bitl works. But the way Rashi explains it sounds like that it's only a shayla because. Uh, when he's being, or maybe it is, the question is, could he be mevatel? Is, is, could you make it non, you know, get? It seems like that you could go ahead and use the same uh, uh, get. But the question is, right, so it's written lishma. Yeah, could you mevatel the lishma? Right. Right, so the question is, does it become a chaspa ba'ama? Does it become mamish? No, because we find by star, for example, that's when you make, when you borrow money. You can't use the same star again because it was only made for that thing. So do you say that now that's it? It's not, it's not, it's not valid anymore. You mavat, you gotta, you gotta write a new one. Well, you say, no, it gets a get. Yeah. Right, right. Yeah, so you say get as a get. You just, you just nullify the agency of. Um... That could be if you have the if you have this concern about if you're miyachet or not, yeah, then then that would be a technicality. But right, let's say it's the same day or something. So on that says the Gemara Machlekes. Nachman Ami says Chayzim Gash, but you could go back and divorce with it again. Rashi Shemesh says no, in a Chayzim Gash, but you cannot go ahead and divorce with it again. The Gemara concludes Vilchus Kavashid Rav Nachman, Lachus Rav Nachman, that you could go ahead and divorce with it again. It's not a bitl in the get. It's a bitl in the shlichus. It's that I don't want this to be activated now, or I don't want the shlichus to be Rashi says it. But the get is still a good get. The Gemara says, "Is that really so?" But we know that Allah He says, "Chizeres." What's chizeres? So Rashi explains the kedushin and perikol emel chaveiray. If someone says to a woman, "Here, I want you to be engaged to me with these monies after thirty days," then within the thirty days, he has a change of heart. He gets introduced to a new girl, and he's like, "Oy vey, I don't want this to take effect after thirty days." So he backs out within thirty days. So that's mavatul the kedushin. Because he was mavatlet before they took effect. Ooh, so says the Gemara. So why don't you say something over here? Just like the Kedush in his bottle, the money is not going to work. So same thing over here. You should say that the get is bottle, that the get shouldn't work. That's how the Gemara, that's how Rash explains the Gemara's question. Vichlan says, you go back out of the Kedush. So why don't you say, oh, and it's mavatl the Kedush. The monies are not going to work anymore. So why don't you say also over here, the get's not going to work anymore. The, the, the money is by her already. And all it needs is 30 days to take effect. It's going to take effect automatically. It's there. She has it. So it yeah, I'm saying money's money, right. So yeah, in the Khanami. So the Gemara says... 
Right. So I'm saying, but 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 so why is the kedusha not working? Right. But the shah is, how could you do that? It is kedusha. So the way the Gemara is understanding it, yeah, I, I hear this word, but the Gemara is understanding it. Rashi explains that the, the kedushin is a kedushin. She has her. It's no, there's no shlichus in Mavatlis. She already has it. How does it not work? Yeah, because you could know it. You can make that it's not a kedushin. Meaning it's not, it's, not, it's not the money that you don't have to make it ois shabi's money. You just have to make it ois kedushin. Or else you make it ois get. It's not like get anymore. So even if you would give it to her, it wouldn't work. That's how the Gemara is understanding right now. Right. Yeah, so the Gemara says, the Gemara, the Gemara says, could you compare the two cases? Hasam Dibur Dibruhu. There, in the beginning, when she was getting engaged, it was through the words that she was willing to be accepting that money as a Kedushan. So, Asa Dibur, you could have the words of retraction, Umavatl Dibur, and nullify the words of the Kedushan. Meaning, there's only, it was only words. When you give money to, when you give a ring to a woman, you give money to the woman. So, what, what's happening over here? What's the, what's the, what's the over here? It's just words. Hareyat Makadashasli. So those words is what made the condition. So words could come along and nullify it. That's it. That's all you have to do. Because it's deeper comes along. Us deeper of Chazar, umavatl deeper of the condition. Now, but like you were saying, the monies are not nullified. If he would go ahead and take those monies and again take the same gelt and get engaged to her with her consent, of course she didn't look at She didn't nullify the gelt. So and he's although over here. When you're saying bottle who the bottle of the of the shlich that you're nullifying the agency of the shlich that it shouldn't be a shlich for him to divorce her with this get so the deeper of making a shlich I mean the deeper of be mavatl him as a shlich can mavatl the original deeper of making a shlich but gita gufe the get itself which is here mika bottle do you think you're nullifying you're not, it's not invalidating it's still it's still what it is just like with the other money is still what it is. So they were, don't ask, at least don't ask on me from Rabbi Yechanan. I could possibly go to Nachman, Chesim Right, but I'm not, no, that's what, that's what, that's what, yeah, that's, so. that's what Rashi explained, but he I'm not. He gives a get without saying, uh, give this get. Would this have any focus? Could be. Yeah. You could just drop off the get and not saying anything? Yeah, it could be. But I'm saying, but. but so then for kids, then for kids, should, should even more so be a condition to be in the battle. Because he can give the get with no dibber, and then he can come with the dibber to be in the battle. So I'm saying, but I'm saying, but the, but the get itself is. It, do we have any raya that it's it's null and void, like a piece of earthenware? We don't have. The Gemara was just asking for Rebbeichan. He said, "How could you say passing like Rav Nachman that you can use it again? I pass like Rebbeichan and the Chazeres. You back out. The the, the get the kedusha not going to work anymore." So said, what do you mean? That's because all you have to battle is the original Debur. I didn't make a This was the Debur, and now the Debur of Chazar will back out on that. The money itself is not bottle. It rules the get. Yeah, your Debur of the Shlichas, you can be bottle with your Debur now. We're backing out, but the get itself. Will still function, and therefore we can pass like Rav Nachman. It's a good question. No, the our case that we have that actually when 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 the guy tells his sister that this money is for this, and you know if he backs out from that, tries what does it mean? Yeah, I mean, l'chayra, it's, it's the, we're saying the Mekech is not happening. L'chayra, I mean, l'chayra, you would get back your money because it was for Kedushan, and then he's backing out of the Kedushan. So l'chayra, you'd get your money back. So, um, yeah, so then Mishnah said that B'rishay Noha Yo'esa, originally what used to happen... If he, if he gave the Kedushan, if he gave Kedushan, meaning... Usually what happens is you give the Kedushan, it happens automatically, and then... And then it's already Kedushan already. Yeah, but if you had, here was because you said that you want to take effect in 30 days. Yeah, if you want to transfer that, yeah, same thing. So the mission of the Bereshit, in the beginning, what used to be was that the guy, he wouldn't try to run after the Shaliyah, he wouldn't try to run after the woman. He would just quickly go right after he sent the Shaliyah. He quickly chop three guys from, from, from the grocery store, and he says, okay, I'm making a bez in Rabbi Yisai, I'm a to get. But then they said, no, you can't do this because of Tikkun Oilam. Now, it now we learned that before Rebbe Mulil's Takana, of saying that we don't let this being done, so at that point in time, when you were able to make your own Bezdin, so in front of how many people could you be Mavatli? Rebbe Machlekes. He says in front of two people. He says in front of three people. Shesh actually asks somewhere here that he says, what's the point of knowing what happened in the past? It's, it's something that was, was. So he says, no, because there is a Manda Amma that says, as we'll see later on, that even though we Rabbi Mulil said you shouldn't, but it is, it will be, it will be bottle. 
So it, it's still it's still Megea. Is it witnesses or based on? Oh, so that's exactly the question that's going to be. So so in front of how many people you have in the battle, this, this is exactly the lumdus of the Machlekes. So Nachman Amish says, Bifnei Beis. He says, okay, it used to be when you didn't have to run after the Shliach, you could just make your own thing. He says, for the two people, Rav Sheshach, but Bifnei Gimel says, for the three people. So what's the Machlekes? Rav Sheshach, but Bifnei Gimel, because Bezdin Kitani. The words are that they used to make Bezdin Acher Bim Kaimai, and the he has to be a Bezdin, which is three. But Nachman Amish says, no, Bifnei Beis, they used to do in front of the two, because Le Beitre Nami Bezdin Karlu. Two people are also called a a, a bezdin, which because um, regarding monetary law, you're right. You need to have three, but over here, it's just really a hayda ba'alma, and for that, two would be enough. So Amr of Nachman says, "No, Minilah says, where did I get this from? That um, two people are called a bezdin." It's not like learn the Mishnah Masechta Shviyas. The Gemara later on, the from the Alv brings it in the parak regarding the halacha prusbul. A prusbal is <clears throat> usually the shemitah year cancels all loans, but if someone wants to avoid this because he doesn't want to violate lo yigos, which is to try to collect, he goes to the bezin. He says, "I'm giving over all my documents to you, the court." So he's not collecting anymore from his from his debtor, just the courts. And they're going to collect from him. So therefore, it's not a violation of lo yigos, and therefore you can do that even after the shemitah year. So he says, I'm going to give over in front of you as getin I'm going to give over you and you, which sounds like two people." And he's calling them Hadayan and Shabbat Makam the judges of that place. So you see that a Bezdin could be with two people. Rav Sheshev said, no, it's not a Raya. A Bezdin is three people. terminology we find many times in Shas. You think the Tana has to be like a peddler who has to go and tell you everything he has? Plainy, plainy, uplainy. You just mentioned plainy, plainy means you know, more than one person, but it, there were three people over there. The Amr of Nachman, he says, he says, where do I get this from? So it's meaning to say that two people are going to be a Bezdin. So it's not. We learned in the Sefer over there by the Mishnah, by Prusbul, it says as follows. So on the bottom of the Prusbul, the judges sign on the bottom, or the witnesses, whichever one. It says, my love, isn't it comparing Dayan to the Edim? It says either one. It compares the judges to the witnesses. My Edim, Shnaim, just like witnesses are two. So to judge also two. Rav Shei says, what, what type of ra is that? How could he eat? How could he eat? No, they are three, and they want two. Then the Gemara just ends off by saying that if you tell me that we're not comparing them, that's how Rav Shei is rejecting Rav Nachman's raya. Why do you have to say judges? Why do you have to say witnesses? In other words, like Rashi explains, obviously that it's enough with one or the other. So just say witnesses, and of course, if the judges, which are three signed, for sure would work. Why, why do you need to say that? There is a chiddush in there. Not to compare that it's enough for two, but to tell you a different halacha. It doesn't make a difference if you wrote in the terminology of judges, meaning the wording in the, in the prusbul, or for example, we were a court. And this guy came along and said to us, I'm giving over to you the court. So even though the, the wording in the document is that of judges, but who signs? Are the wit- witnesses meaning in the, in the terminology of witnesses? Ish plainy aid, ish plainy aid. So though the wording of the document is indicating who's writing this are the judges, but, the, but they could sign like witnesses. And relation to custom plus aid doesn't make a difference if it's written in the terminology of the document of testimony. For example, Dukhran Sadusa, we recall this testimony of Bampan that was in front of us, and still they sign the bottom like judges, that's the khidish of Allah, but not to say that it would be enough with. Uh, two, and that's the machlekes regarding do you need two or do you need three? Thank you to any time for hosting us.